The benefits of physical activity are likely universal for all children, including students with disabilities. By law, physical education must be made available to every child with a disability. Adaptive physical education refers to the adaptations or modifications students need to access the physical education curriculum. In this video, Nick Pete is proud to showcase the importance of physical education for all students. Nice. So when I first started working with Adriana, she would not copy a movement. And so we all used the same phrase, do this. And that meant to Adriana, focus on the person, do whatever they're doing. And that's where she started her learning. Yes. I can actually give her a visual and once she's learned those exercises, she can be totally independent. And that's gonna carry over to when she's out of school, when she goes to Planet Fitness or the YMCA. She has just come so far. Our daughter is nonverbal and autistic, but she has been communicating using a device. I've been surprised by her physical growth because I've witnessed her doing things that I previously didn't think she'd be able to do. And she could socialize with the peer too. I like to see her happy, I like to see her growing, and it's good for her growth motor skills. I couldn't believe that when I see the improvement, the develop, she become a strong girl now. So much of what we recommend in the medical realm is operationalized in schools. That physical education is where he probably gets most of his social interaction. He's going to participate with his peers. He's going to be able to go to a physical education class and not be made to feel different because things are adapted for him. At the end of the day, I know that my son has an education plan that's built for him, that he's going to make meaningful participation in areas such as physical education and not just in his therapies. I think my favorite thing about today was being able to do what other people would doing and not have to do something else. I think it just makes it more fun when you're doing something together with somebody than doing it alone. Physical education for students with disabilities can occur in a variety of settings, such as general physical education or adapted physical education class. Placement decisions will depend on the individual child, the school, and the services offered. I love my job because I get to uh, move every single day with kids and I love to get to see that aha moment in their eyes or the spark um, when they learn something new, um, whether it is climbing up a wall, whether it is when they're first starting to kick a ball, um, and just the happiness that comes out. So my overall teaching philosophy on um, phys ed is just to get every kid interested in some type of physical movement. I want to give them as many experiences as I can throughout their time here in the proper way so that they don't go out and try something, get hurt, and say, I never want to do that again. I want to give them a safe environment, a fun environment for them to be able to experience and be physically active and physically literate for their life. Every student does participate in PE here at Little Harbor and that's not just a me thing. I'm fortunate enough that I've got a team um, in this school who are really helping students uh, be successful in here and that's either previewing the class with them, um, whether it's someone who's working with them in their classroom, uh, whether it's the adapted PE teacher, and then also my goal is to create lessons that are open for all students to be able to participate. It's fun and I've never done it before and I kind of learn better and I kind of know what to do on a skateboard. All right, friends, are you ready? Gym time is starting. For that self-contained autism starting. class, they start by sitting at the circle. Gym time is starting. And it's then we do a sing. greeting song, uh, and then we do a warm up our body song. And then I do like to add new parts to it. Like today, we did a balloon with a pickleball racket. So that was something new. So I just said it's something new. And then we, and then we went through it together. Want to try one more? Good, nice job, Aaliyah. Uh, but it is, a, it is a balancing act. When students with disabilities need extra support to benefit from general physical education, or when students need a special physical education program, they qualify for specially designed physical education or adapted physical education. Some states require a specific adapted physical education endorsement, while others require a certification in physical education in order to teach students with disabilities. 
If they don't practice it when they're younger, they're never gonna do it when they're older. As humans, we have to move around in life and being physically literate or physically active is very important for your health, but also just your daily interaction um, with the world around you. And I think that's the whole thing, as long as the physical education program um, is appropriate for everyone, um, it really helps those students become that physically literate or comfort um, just in moving, which I think is so huge.